podcasts you love. From people you trust. This is Twit. Audio bandwidth for the Daily Gizwiz is provided by AOL Music and Spinner.com, where you can get free MP3s, exclusive interviews, and more. Video bandwidth for the Daily Gizwiz is provided by Cashfly at C A C H E F L Y dot com. It's time for the Daily Gizwiz with Mad's maddest writer, Dick D. Bartolo. This is episode 1062 for Tuesday, April 6th, 2010, the Targus Premium Laptop Charger. And now, get ready for Dick. Hey, Dick DiMortolo, Mads, Maddest Writer, and the Gizwiz. There's one day a week, that's all we can stand, when Leo comes up with a gadget from under his desk for Turn the Table Tuesday. How are you? Good to see you. Turn the table. The same, Leo. I hear that this is like possibly the fourth week in a row. No. That you, no. Oh, it's another piece of crap. Yeah, don't get your hopes up. (laughs) Okay. Okay. (laughs) Well, you showed us a box yesterday. I should have known it was a scam. The pressure that you put on me each and every Tuesday. No, no. Come up with something good. I've come to like. You doing the bad stuff because I know. that brings the good mail. <laughs> so this uh, Targus, uh, you know Targus very well. They, oh yeah, uh, they do. Targus. They make all kinds of laptop accessories yeah. and, and carry cases. And uh, this is this is something new from Targus. It's their premium laptop charger. Mm. Char- but this is why I got it. It charges laptop and phone at one time. It has two, not one, two tips. But even better than that, it's so small. I've never seen a laptop brick as small as this. This is the brick on the laptop charger. Look at that. It's about the size of a pack of cigarettes. Wow. Oh, I like the fact that the plug is built. So you only need a cable at one end. You'd only need a cable at one end. The plug is at one end. It plugs into the wall. In fact, it's kind of suitable for just hanging off the plug socket like yeah. that. Yeah. And then it comes with, and Targus has, has done this for a while. It comes with a number of tips. So here's the cable that, that goes with it. Um, and uh, you can you can not only, let me pull this out here. You can not only uh, plug this into the wall if you want. So this is if you plug it into the wall, it has a little transformer. That's the thing the size of a pack of cigarettes. And then you plug into that the cable. I'll uh, un- untie this here. I've had it out, but I, I put it all back in because I wanted well, you to think well, it was up to, up, up to what size laptop can you charge? Like, I have an 18-inch HP, and I think it takes, like, a monster brick. Yeah, you know, I mean, that might be one of the issues with this. Let me look at see. I think it's... But, it's, you know, I bet it I bet it does the all the netbooks and, and probably the 14- oh, yeah. and 15-inch guys. Let, let me see what they say about that. It's the number of watts that it provides. Yeah, I, I think... I think my HP might be 70 watts, and I think most of them are let like me, 20 to that's 50. That's a very, very so. good question, and let me just see if I can find that information here. Uh, oh. It's probably mm-hmm. somewhere on this. Uh, it does um, 75 watts. Wow. Okay, then it should cover pretty much everything. And, you know, an AC adapter will give you 90 watts continuous power. So okay. if you plug this into the wall, and it will power anything that has a 90 watt or less laptop. That's that's pretty much that's pretty much all the ones I, I know. Yeah. Can. And for the if you now, and this is what I was going to say, is it also comes with so it has this wall adapter, but it also comes with a cigarette lighter adapter. So this is what I got it for. So I plug. The cable into, so you, you have the choice of plugging the cable into the AC adapter or the cigarette lighter adapter. Now, oh. I, I could put this in my car. Now, that's only 75 watts. That's where the 75 watts came from. Because you, oh, okay. you don't want to. Okay. It says 90 watts burst, but it, but 70 watts, it's 5 watts continues. And then it has two tips. It comes with two tips. Now, one of them can be a USB adapter for your phone. Uh, it comes with a number of tips in the box. And Targus has been doing this for a while. Where, hey, stop. I'm still talking here. I'm talking here. Thank you. <laughs> it comes with a bunch of tips already out of the box, right. including, and I really I really like this, the iPhone dock tip. So I can charge my iPhone wow. and a laptop with it. 
if if the total is less than 90 watts. Uh, it comes with a bunch of laptop tips for Acer, Asus, Compaq, Dell, Fujitsu, HP, IBM, Lenovo, Panasonic, Sony, and Toshiba laptops. And when you wow. register it, you get another one free. Wow. So, Leo, that, that has got to be on the pricey side is my guess. Oh, of course, but I don't know how much. Let me let me check real quick. Oh, okay. Quickly. <laughs> you know, I I you you you're so good at preparing this stuff. And I and I and I try to keep up with you, Dick. And I always am thinking, what would Dick do? He probably would know <laughs> the price, wouldn't he, of this. So let me check real quickly. The target okay. Yeah, no, that's okay. It's a little pricey on Amazon 132 bucks. Okay. Okay. So that's a little pricey. What? But you know, ninety yeah. it'll be ninety bucks for a, a replacement adapter for your laptop. I was laptop just going to anyway. say, if you buy, you know, the the uh, laptop manufacturer's thing, so this is like ten to twenty bucks more. But this you'll have forever. And it charges two things, and it charges in my car. And part of the reason is I have I carry two phones now in my car, and I wanted two chargers that I could plug into my cigarette lighter and charge both my my phones. And now I can finally. Oh, okay. Do that. So you can you can use it to charge any two items. One doesn't have to be a laptop. No, no, no. it's got these. It's oh. kind of this very flexible. See these tips. These tips are removable. Oh, yes. So you get two two generic uh, connectors, and then you you get the tip that's appropriate for the device. Now the one thing, and I asked them, and they said no, we we don't because Apple has patented their MagSafe adapter. It will not work with oh. PowerBooks or Macintoshes because that's why Apple, of course, came up with the MagSafe so that they could be the only source of adapters for the Macintosh. But uh, this way, I could plug this into the car, charge my iPhone and my Nexus One, if that's what I want to do, or our laptop. You're right. It would really be good for um, my uh, netbook that I carry around with me uh, to keep it charged. So this is the t this 132 bucks. the Targus. It's called the Premium Laptop Charger Piano Black, which is kind of nice, that shiny black. So it looks good, you know, you're carrying around. Not too heavy either. I'd say that's about um, half a pound, maybe. And uh, you, maybe a pound. You carry that around and you're set. You got everything wow. you want. Yep. Lightweight, versatile, multitude of tips. Register at Targus. And you could charge your BlackBerry and your laptop or your BlackBerry and your iPhone or your iPhone and your laptop and get it all get it all done. Nice. They say nice. also, they, they do say, and I don't see it here, that it also will work on airplanes. Let me see if maybe I'm missing... Oh, there's even more in here. I don't, I don't know if it'll charge on the airplane. I think it doesn't have the airplane tip. Okay. But you know what, Leo? I was, was noticing on the, the you know, I'm a Continental Flyer, that all their new planes now have... They all have, have USB or plugs, I know, yeah. Have regular AC, yep. uh, two AC adapters between three coach seats, and then one regular AC adapted at every first class seat. So I guess all the new aircraft will eliminate needing that actual airplane adapter i wonder if this would double the cigarette lighter because doesn't doesn't the old airplane adapter look like a cigarette lighter no it's it it's, it's, it's slightly like no it, it's, it's slightly different, different. it's okay. a different kind of plug okay. yeah i don't think that will do it but my doctor had something like that it's nice it says mobile laptop charger so i don't know but okay. yeah you use either this or the brick because you don't need a transformer for the dc power that comes out of your car yeah. You know, maybe some airplanes have that adapter now, so it, it's the same as cars as, as a aircraft. That could be, right, too. Right. Del Mini. But don't take our word for it. Don't take our word for it. Check the website. Because we, we don't know what we're talking about. <laughs> no, we do know what we're we talking about. We do know about. what we're talking Just about. not all the time. <laughs> Most of the time. Sometimes, sometimes we could know what we're talking about. We might know what we're talking about. We're not sure if we know what we're talking about. But if you ask me, I'll talk about it. And you forgot one. And if we don't know about it, yes. we that won't stop us from talking about Absolutely it. Absolutely not. No. What are no. we talking about? Um, did you have a letter? I don't know what we're talking about. But that <laughs> didn't stop me. <laughs> Ladies no, and gentlemen, no. I do have a letter. This comes from Barbara Snyder, who did, uh, for, she's the embroidery to order lady, who did our Gizwiz uh, 900 pouches. Remember those? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I do. Yes. We've never really figured out what to do with them, but we've got them. Oh, I use mine all the time. <laughs> Do you? 
<laughs> yeah, I put two pouches in the one pouch. <laughs> yeah, there you go. You yeah. never run out. Oh, there you go. You've there always you go. got it where you want it. Hello from your embroidery friend in Sebastopol that's just up the road a bit. I hope you're still finding good uses for the episode 900 pouches I embroidered for you. Uh, I think Leo would <laughs> be very interested in this neat little app, the perfect accompaniment to the sleep phones. Remember I had those headphones that uh, Grammar Girl gave me that allow you to listen to your uh, music or whatever while you're sleeping and then like yes, a little headband? Yes, yes, yes. It's called the Doze Guard. It's only 99 Oh, that's the Daily Gizwiz, isn't it? <laughs> yes, that's us. The Doze Guards. No, no, we're the Doze Makers. Oh, the Doze Makers. Yeah, right, we, okay. we make you Doze. The Doze Guard, I guess... Keeps you from guarding your doze. D O Z E. Well, let me tell you what it is. she says. There's a light version if you want to try it first. It's a. I guess it's. It goes on your uh, iPhone. It's an iPhone application. You set it for how long you want your book or podcast to play after the last time you move the phone. See, because this is always a problem for me, is that you know I've got sleep timers and stuff on a lot of my music players and stuff, but but. I, you know, you got to set it and so forth. So this way, you don't have to. You don't have to worry if you forget to set it. Say you tend to fall asleep. She says after about ten minutes after you turn off the light, open Doze Guard. Oh, oh, set I it for see. ten minutes. Start playing or resuming a track. Then you put the iPhone down. Turn off the light. If you don't move the phone for ten minutes, the track stops playing. If you do move it again, maybe you're tossing or turning, or you get up, just you know, jiggle the phone. You get another ten minutes. And of course, you only you know you can resume from playing from uh, where you stopped the track. The first That's revision worked only with audiobooks, but this is one point one. It'll work with anything in your library. I'm gonna add. That's a great tip. This is an iPhone app, or I guess it would work on the iPod Touch and probably on the iPad. I have to try it. Ninety nine cents for the full version. There's a light version. And uh, what a good idea! And you get the little slider that you can say, uh, you know. Oh, how many minutes how you many want? How many minutes? Yeah, if you don't move. That's nice. Yeah, yeah. that's good. This is good. Thank you and very it's, much. It's a buck? Is that all? It's a buck. Well, iPhone apps are so cheap. <sighs> so cheap. Thank you, Barbara. Barbara Snyder. She's a embroidery to EMB2, the number two order, O-D-E-R, dot -E com. And uh, she's got her, you know, information there if you want to order stuff. She does a lot of embroidery stuff. Look at this. Look at this. She does... She's she just wow. she must have one of those uh, sewing machines that embroiders. Look at that stained glass window. Wow! Here's one for you. This is what you should. I have. I think embroidered stained glass windows are hard to see through. <sighs> Man, can you imagine how hard it is to get the needle through there to embroider it? <laughs> Very. Cool. Oh, it's a cute. Yeah, it's a little, uh, it's a little monkey puppet. I wonder if she has our. There it is. Up oh, there it is. There's the pouch. Wow! Do you realize that night. And what, this is 10,062 1,062. I mean, 1,062. Yes, if it were 10,062, like 10, you and I would be like 83. Hey, that's if I turn the table Tuesday, Dick. Yeah. Uh, the, let's see, the, what was it? The Targo? You the Targo told that food. joke on episode 8,974. <laughs> I remember. I was going to say. Do I ever do the nano mouse? <laughs> yeah, and MX, okay, yeah, Leo, MX Nano. Be... It's a great <laughs> mouse. <laughs> it's the 38th time, Leo. Look oh. at the chat room. It's oh. the 39th time. Oh. <sighs> All right, my friend. I think I have completed my uh, my uh, job here. My job here is done. you did a done. grand job. Well, thank goodness. This pressure. Now what? Four in a row that weren't crap? Four in a row that weren't crap. Something to be proud of. I didn't say they were I good. Think she should she should knit you something for the wall that says four and a one and no crap yet. <laughs> like the little tailor who killed nine with one blow. Yes. He was talking flies. They thought he was talking giants. It all got out of hand. Well, you know the story. Dick, I will see you tomorrow. I'll be here. D A I L. Why? It's the Daily Giz Whiz. It's the Daily Giz Whiz. It's the Daily Giz Whiz. It makes its own gravy. Why?